I have recently been asked where I work. The answer is both simple and complex. I work at CPC. It means the Caspian Pipeline Consortium. We move crude oil from Kazakhstan and the Caspian Shelf. It used to be difficult as Kazakhstan is landlocked and the nearest sea is the Caspian. A wide path needed to be open for Kazakh oil to the consumer. One can move oil over a long distance in different ways, but an oil pipeline is the best. In the 1990s, oil giants from Russia, Kazakhstan, the USA, Great Britain, Italy, and elsewhere jointly formed the CPC. Construction began in November 1999, and the first tanker was loaded in October 2001. At first, we pumped 28 million tons per annum. Now we can do up to 67 MTA, and that's not the limit. 75% of Kazakhstan's oil exports go through the CPC pipeline. Russian oil is added on the way, so we receive a CPC blend which is in demand in the world market. We have an oil quality bank, so the CPC blend quality is always stable. Our pipeline is 1,500 kilometers long. In Kazakhstan, it skirts round north of the Caspian, and in Russia, passes through Kalmykia, the Astrakhan, Stavropol, and Krasnodar regions, and ends near Novorossiysk. From there, the oil goes on to various corners of the globe in tankers. CPC uses modern oil pumping and loading technologies. Not a drop of oil falls into the environment. Wildlife is the best evidence. Herds of saigas graze on the plains of Kazakhstan and Kalmyka, above our pipeline. Schools of dolphins can be seen next to CPC's single point moorings on the Black Sea, where tankers moor to be loaded. CPC builds kindergartens, schools, hospitals, and sport facilities. This is CPC's real contribution to the development of the regions crossed by the pipeline. There are over 1,500 people working for CPC, and the company really cares about the conditions we live in, how our children grow, and where they go to school. So, in answer to the question, where do you work? I reply with pride. I work at CPC. Caspian Pipeline Consortium, an international project tested by time.